This house at 719 Southeast 1st Street was built by Marcus Sontag, a man of many titles. He was born on February 17, 1859 in Evansville, Indiana. Sontag was the oldest of five boys. In 1884, he married Miss Genevieve Cook and they had two daughters. When he first began his adult life, he started a real estate company with his brother titled Sontag Brothers Insurance. He then started the Union Investment Company, which built over 300 houses and was instrumental in the development of Evansville in the 1920s. He also built and owned the Sontag Hotel, which now is home to Signature School on Evansville's Main Street. He was president of many companies during his lifetime, including American Trust and Savings Company, American Stove and Range Works, and Union Investment Company. He also served on several community boards of directors, such as the Board of Public Schools, Associated Charities of Evansville, and the Evansville Board of Underwriters. He died of a heart attack on August 25, 1936, at the age of 77. In 1902, he had this home built on Southeast 1st Street in downtown Evansville. The architect who designed the home was Clifford Shotbell. He also designed many other homes in Evansville during that time. The home is 4,682 square feet and is in the Georgian Revival style. It features Palladian style windows in the gable and on the first floors of the house. The roof is low pitch with a gable front. It has medallions lining the gable and eaves. It features four prominent columns supporting the projecting portico. It also features a palladium style front door with a round arch transom and side lights. The home was last remodeled in 1990.